hello everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i will be filming a requested one which is safe versus unsafe treats and how often to feed them so let's start off with unsafe treats so firstly you should be avoiding any treats that are brightly colored or dyed these are completely unnatural and you should not be feeding them because they're just not very good for your bunny's health next is seeds nuts and dairy so there's a lot of treats that contain seeds so definitely avoid those as well as yogurt drops they're a very common treat that are marketed to bunny however please 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 do not feed any of these treats because your bunnies cannot properly digest them bunnies are strictly herbivores and they are designed to only digest plant matter so like grass haze bark sticks that kind of thing they are not meant to be eating any dairy or seeds because they are not designed to digest them so when your bunny eats any products that contain these dangerous items they can very easily upset their stomachs and can also lead to gi stasis so now let's talk about safe treats so probably the most obvious one are fruit and veggies so these are probably the best treats you can give to your bunnies because they are natural and are not processed in any ways so firstly let's talk about vegetables so there's a number of different safe vegetables i will list a few on the screen but i will also link a page down below where you can see all the safe fruits and veggies my personal favorite vegetables to feed to my bunnies are carrots bell peppers however oakley does not like bell peppers but willow does so definitely try out carrots and bell peppers they are my bunny's favorite so those are probably the only two vegetables that i feed my bunnies but there are many others if you want to check out that page linked below and for how much to feed them it definitely depends on you and your bunnies and the size of them but the general rule is one tablespoon for every two pounds of bunny and in terms of how often to feed them it just depends personally i would only feed them vegetables four to five times a week in very small amounts so next let's move on to fruits which is also another great natural treat for your bunnies so there are many different fruits that you can feed to your bunny there will once again be a page linked down below which you can check out also but my favorite treats are apples bananas and berries i also like to give a small amount of watermelon on hot days but with fruits, you definitely have to make sure you're feeding them very sparingly, not in large amounts, because they are even higher in sugar than vegetables. So you definitely want to watch out for the amount you're giving your bunnies. Personally, I would say one to two times a week is good. I know there are people who say even more than that is okay, but I would definitely be careful with it because they are so high in sugar and you do not want to affect your bunny's health in any way. And for the amount of fruit you can feed your bunny, it's one teaspoon for every two pounds of bunny. So there's actually a few different ways you can give your bunnies fruit. Fresh fruit, freeze dried fruit and dried fruit, which are all very tasty to your bunny. And you can provide them in their different forms just for some variety. And finally, we have the more processed treats. These are totally optional and you don't have to feed them at all. I know a lot of people actually say that they can be harmful, but for me, there's only really two brands that I like to feed to my bunnies and make sure that it's only occasionally. And the ones that I like to feed are the Oxbow Simple Rewards Bake Treats. So these are hay based and you can buy them in a variety of different flavors. These ones here are just the cranberry, but there's a bunch of different flavors as well and just be careful not to feed them too often so on the back it actually says to feed them up to two pieces a day which you definitely shouldn't be doing i feel like that's way too much so for me i only give half a treat every other day and also the meadow loops by selective naturals my bunnies really like these and once again i only feed half every other day so forage is another amazing treat that you can give to your bunnies which are basically dried flowers and leaves. Oakley's just up here eating some forage right now. And I just gave him some of this. I don't have much left in here, but this is basically different dried flowers. I've got dried roses and some calendula and a bunch of other flowers as well. And I think that dried flowers are an amazing treat that you can add into your bunny's diet. And you can give these to your bunnies in different enrichment items. I like to put them in hay so it's like a little forage blend 
I've also got this wooden hay feeder and I just like to put hay in here and sprinkle some of that dried forage in so they can get some more hay into their diet and also have an opportunity to forage. You can also give it to them in their snuffle mats or stacking cups. There's a bunch of other ways as well. So I think forage is a great treat to provide to your bunnies. So an important thing to remember is variety and moderation is key when giving your bunnies treats. So firstly, remember not to give too many a day and also to rotate them and not give the same treats all the time. So for me, I love rotating them. One day I may give them a type of vegetable, then the next day a fruit, then some forage. So I definitely wouldn't give more than one type of treat a day. So it's just up to your own judgment and what you think is enough. Just remember moderation is key with bunnies. You don't want to upset their sensitive stomachs. So that is all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed and maybe learned something as well. And just a reminder, if you've got any unsafe treats in your house sitting around, make sure you throw them out because you do not want to hurt your bunny in any way. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.